Mishborn defenseman plays cross ice in stride here as the top unit is out to Nicholas Puikinen and now slowly sliced over towards Vanagonia. Wind up shot, kicks over near side, they score! Of the waiting Salem, he will play cross ice. Corcoran winds up, he scores! Sixteen oh six to go here in period number one, and it's a tie game. Kennedy tries to spin away from a defender, and he ended up turning it over. Now three on two, shorthanded the other way. Left over for Allen, backdoor feed, lifted, they score! Eleven fifty-five to go in period number one, and the Bulls only needed four skaters on the ice. Devin Tung reaching back for this, slowly popping free. Onto that far side, Hathaway has to play keep away. Picked off by Trello, walking in, wrist a shot, a rebound, plus it gets over, another loose puck, they score! <laughs> Near side. Fresh onto the ice is Kyler Yo. And he's reaching for that puck, and Deneen shielded it away. So into the offensive end, that's where Stapleton leaves it for Black, he scores! Ty Black with 18.50 to go in period number two, makes it four to one. He walked in to the slot. Staple, the tall centerman for Amarillo on the top line, set to take an offensive zone draw to the near side of the ice. He wins it back, given off to Matt Allen. Throws through traffic, Allen scores! The captain makes it five to one. Just beyond the midway point of period number two. The Air Force commit gets around his man, but does not have clean possession of the puck. It's fed back over to McArdle. One touched over to Bezik through traffic, skipping puck. Rebound, loose puck, they score! <laughs> Ty Black there to clean up the dirty laundry from Josh Wankford, and it's 6-1 to one with 17.55 left to go in regulation. So they will pick up the win, but the Bulls will pick up the 6-1 to one victory here on Friday night as the horn will sound. And Amarillo has won six in a row.